dancing like you're smiling in the morning. Hello, family Lisa, and welcome back to the channel. So, as always, it's going to be a very packed week. And today, I am going to an Estee Lauder event. The theme is nude or neutrals. And I want to quickly share my OOTD. I am wearing the super cute wide leg jumpsuit from Love Bonito, my favorite. You guys know how much I love the brand. It's so comfy. It has pockets on the side. And then the shoes or the heels I'm wearing is also from Love Bonito. I have this in red as well. And I will put my discount code here so you guys can get a 15% discount whenever you shop at the site. And also link below for the chain belt. I'm also going to Bohol very very soon so I'm going to include that here on the vlog. And yeah, as always before we start with the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that you're always notified when I have new videos like this. Lauder's Double Wear Foundation has a 24-hour staying power and gives off a matte finish. I personally got to try this one during their event last year and fell in love with it. Random fact about me, my number one favorite makeup product is foundation. I've tried a lot of brands and this is one of my absolute favorites. It doesn't feel heavy or cakey on the face and you can even mix it with their advanced night serum for a dewy or glassy look. Celebrity photographer BJ Pasquale was also officially launched as the brand's regional ambassador. I've met PJ a few times, although I honestly got a bit shy to say hi and to congratulate him. Proud of him though for representing our country and the LGBTQ community. So I never leave. days when I don't have time to go to the gym, I go on YouTube and follow certain workouts. This is one of my favorites and it is a killer for the legs and butt. Check out the link below if you want to try this workout as well. I also wear ankle weights for that extra burn. Just to clarify, I am no fitness expert but I want to share what I have been doing and what works for me. protein shake within 30 minutes after I finish my workout, then I just try to eat mindfully the rest of the day. I am not so strict when it comes to food, but I make sure to eat fruits, veggies, or make my green juice. I know it sounds cliche, but health is really wealth, so don't forget to take care of yourself. I am also doing Pilates 2-3 to three times a week because I really want to be more flexible and stronger this year. Mm -hmm. 
Pilates has done wonders for me both physically and mentally. And I guess it's pretty obvious here on my channel how much I love this workout because I post about it a lot. The workout sets I'm wearing here are from Love Bonito and as always don't forget to use my code LBXLISA to get a discount when you shop at the site. I've also been doing indoor cycling for cardio and to incorporate something different in my workout routine. I feel like my body is so used to moving that there are times I hit the plateau. When that happens, I try out new workouts or I give myself a week-long break to rest and recharge. This is a must so that I can perform and do better. or parang my personal tip is to shoot it before eating para flat yung tummy and also mas harsh yung light the better it is yung shadows dun sa body mo but yeah in a bit I'm going to show you how I eat so sobrang dami ng food but I want to try everything so little of each lang kasi also aside from this being a work trip it's a vacation for me and I want to enjoy so um, I work out, I work hard um, for this trip, so I also want to enjoy it. Workout naman ako for workout extra harder for this trip. Wow! So feeling ko at least now maka enjoy ya. Do you still work out when you're at the beach? Yes. I brought three sets of workout clothes. Workout items. Uh, ah, boba. Mango and then cheese ice cream. No mango ice cream, also and cornflakes. Paano na? Paano na? <laughs> Guys, we're going on a <laughs> how to prepare a beach for a beach trip. Island how to lamon during a beach trip. Pala yung vlog. <laughs> so paano na? Game. Game, game, game. Okay.
still going to be in Bohol for a few more days but I'm going to end it here because I don't want to bore you guys and I hope you enjoy this. The point is I know I work out hard and especially if I have a beach trip, I must work out harder. Ako. Especially now, na one of my fitness goals is to be stronger. Super inspired the host of Physical 100. Please watch it if you haven't seen it. And also, I want to build my butt, which is another reason why I'm not so strict with food. Because I know I need to eat more if I want to build muscle, especially in the butt, ko, right? And also, guys, I've honestly come a long way. Like, I remember around 2014, I was really so strict with my food. Pag may beach trip ako, nagbabaon ako ng kamote. Para super, like, drained ako for my photos. And pag may dessert, I would just smell it. Like, medyo extreme talaga ako noon. But now, I don't know if it's because I'm getting like older, but I've learned to let loose. And I noticed that na even if I'm not so strict with my food, I'm still happy with you know how my body looks. I'm happy with how I feel. And at the end of the day, I think that's what matters. Naman. And also again, guys, I'm not a pro when it comes to diet or fitness. I just want to share it. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!